Hello everyone, the topic for today is foreign income. If you are resident for tax purposes, you must include your local Australian income as well as foreign income. By law, you have to declare your foreign income. Foreign income means income from any source uh, in overseas, can be Europe, can be Asia, can be New Zealand, can be America. Income from all the sources, you must include it here. You must include the income earned as well as the tax paid in those countries because you get a credit for that because of double taxation. So let us say you earn 100,000 in US and you paid about 30,000 tax there. So you must include 100,000 income here as overseas income and 30,000 tax which you have paid in US as, in, in, uh, you know, as a tax paid here. So here in Australia, if on that income the tax payable is 40,000, then you will pay extra 10,000 here. But in case you have paid more tax in US, then you will not get a refund here because you don't get a refund of foreign tax credit. Now, the rules have been tightened. The tax office is very strict on the foreign income. You must include now the country name from where you have uh, you know, generated the income. You must include the amount, the conversion rate, and the franking credit. Let's say you have got some, you received some dividend in New Zealand or some other country, and you received some franking credit, that amount also you have to be included. So make sure you include your foreign income. That is very important because ATO is very strict on that. They have mentioned in their lot of publications that you need to include it now. There is no exemption, there is no concession on that. If you have any problems, just give us a call or register on our website and we will help you. Thanks for watching. Bye.